Hi, welcome to my tutorial on creating subtitles with AGSub. You can download the program for free at agsub.org. This program is available for both Windows and Mac, so just download the right one for you. Now I'll open the program and show you what it can do. I'm going to import an MP3 through the Audio tab. For this example, we'll use the song Waymaker. Let's find out where the first line of the song begins. We'll select a range and play it to see if we found it. You are here Now that we found the first line, let's adjust the range to be more accurate. You are here, moving in the midst. I worship you. I worship you. Now that the range is accurate, we can start typing in the line. You can see here that I type backslash n. This will tell the program to display this section in a second line of text. When ready, click the check mark to save and move on to the next phrase. Use the visual guide to determine where the next phrase ends. When done selecting the range, play it to check if it is correct. You are here, working in this place. I worship you. I worship you. Again, we can start typing in the line and check mark when done. Although this method is pretty straightforward, there's a lot of typing to do. Since we already have the lyrics, we can just import them in. For this example, I'll demonstrate just verse 1 and chorus. Since the song flow is verse 1, verse 1, chorus, chorus, we'll have to rearrange the lyrics. Let's also add the backslash in so we can display two lines of text at a time. I'll just name this file as practice. Now we can go to File, Open Subtitles, and pick our practice file. AGSub has additional options to differentiate different voices and add comments. But we don't need them for this tutorial. Just click OK. Now you can see that by just modifying the original lyrics a little, we have all our lines of text waiting for us. Let's adjust the range for the first line, play for to verify accuracy, then check mark when done. You are here moving in. I worship you, I worship you. 
Next, we adjust the range for the next line of text, and so on. For greater accuracy, you can zoom in for the timing as well as for the volume. Now that we are finished, let's see what these subtitles look like on a dummy video. You are here, moving in our midst. I worship you. I worship you. You are here, working in this place. I worship you. I worship you. You are here. Now that we confirmed that the subtitle timing is correct, let's save the file. File, 
export subtitles. file name.srt. Let's take a look at the finished SRT file. 